Yeah. I, I think Swedish is pretty good versus Teach. Um, oh, jeez. Swedish coming right out the gates. Oh, kind of put himself out there on that edge guard, though. Oh, right, June Bug's another shoot. Wow, Lod took the control, like, right back. Oh, he's living. Wow, whoa, he missed that forward air. I'm surprised. Good edge guard. He just kind of kept a hitbox out. Whoa, Swedish made it back up. That should be a kill. What is up with it? Okay. Okay, so, so Swedish came easy. out, like, right away, started beating him up, but then Lod started beating him up back, and then Swedish managed to take the sock first up. Nice grab. That was a really quick grab, man. Yeah. Get up, down smash. Oh, no. Yeah. Wait, did he? Oh, I thought he would do the overtry for us and like up into the turn up. I wonder if Switch can do that, or if he knows about it. Who? A Swedish like oh, knows about it. Oh, okay. Oh, no. That platform height is very dangerous for speech. I'm surprised Swedish won here because he should have been looking that log, that log counter picked here. Uh, I mean, I maybe just like you know, Swedish feels good on the stage. Yeah, I mean, I think this is one of his Plus favorite Plus, maybe he figures, like, it, they're going to end up going here anyway at some point. Oh, nice Nair. It's actually pretty trippy oh. when people uh, pick an aggressive option right after a defensive option. A lot of good players, what they do is that when someone picks a defensive option, they look for another defensive option right after. Right. But, uh, but what, then you just start hitting them. Y yeah, but then, like, a I lot mean, of... they start hitting, yeah. A lot of West Coast players do that, where they're like... Oh. Dude, he's playing Sheik versus Peach right now. Yeah, jeez. <laughs> okay, Swedish <laughs> forward air. Swedish all of a sudden started going Wow, there. amazing reverse forward air. Yeah. Because this was very even, and then... Jeez. I mean, Wad... Wow. He, uh, he did lose that stock in part because he looked for a janky down smash. Swedish was doing, like, a beast all, and Wad just, like, walked over and down smash. It's just like, yeah. that, that doesn't work. <laughs> like, you were just kind of hoping that, you know... Lot is getting like a lot of mileage off these down smashes. Like each, every yeah. single one is getting like three hits. Yeah, wait, all of a sudden this is almost even. Yeah, I mean one. Two. Ooh, good air. Yeah, good jump read. See Yeah, I think maybe ledge there. Yeah. And then just, you know, get I mean up. you can hit Sheik at the start of her up B, yeah, true. but he kept doing it and it kept not working. Okay, this is a... Uh... Wow, interesting down. I yeah, actually that was Smart, I guess. It kept Peach above, which is kind of what you want. Yeah. Maybe if Swedish forward air, then Wad could have gone to the ledge pretty fast. It's right. Uh, I mean, but I'm if you down air, you know. it's like he has to get down somewhere else. And now he has 10 more percent. Mm -hmm. okay. FD, um, what do you think? Do you agree? Whoa, Stitch, catch it. <laughs> I'm all, all concede that I do not know much about this matchup, especially stage considerations. But this seems like a very straight. Okay, there he got it. He got it. Okay. Right, like that's a really important edge guard versus Peach. He got the bear because he kept trying to get that bear last. Yeah, game. he was just missing by a little bit. Yeah. Okay, that's nice. Start. Yeah, you know, I as I say, I can't really oh, comment. Oh, nice. nice. I can't really comment on the counter pick, but it looks like Lot's using it really well. Uh, you know, it's working, so I'll I'll say sure. So <laughs> I want to point out that the combo he did was a combo that's a very specific FD combo. He did. Uh, down tilt, and then up air, and then he did up air again. And that's interesting because what he's doing is not setting up for an edge guard, but setting up for like an aerial chase. Right, and that FD, doesn't happen many other places. Yeah, FD is going to be the best stage to do that because there's no platforms for Swedish to go to. Uh, so he seems to really be comfortable on this stage. Mm. Oh, good weight. Yeah. Kind of knew it's about that. I mean, what else is Peach going to do, you know? They yeah. usually... Sometimes, I mean, as Mango says, you just have to do the only option you've got and just make your opponent respect it. Right. Oh, wow, that was 16%. Oh, but he got super punished for, for it. For air to, um, I don't know how that happened. Yeah. Did he, like, burn his double jump somewhere? I mean, I saw him air dodge, but, like, I, ooh, oh, that was almost really good. Like, he waited for the down smash, but then he ran into it too soon. Yeah. This is crazy. 
Yeah, Wild's looking this real a, good this game. This is a huge turnaround. I mean, it's really impressive. This is going to be really hard for Swedish to bring back. Peach is a character really good at trading and exact. Yeah, yeah that, that'll just get on. Okay, yeah. Nice. Well-timed neutral get on. Um, where will Swedish go? <laughs> I heard him say Battlefield. Whoa. No, neither of them are going to switch. Neither of them play. Jeez. I'm not going to lie. I had no clue Lod was this good. I had heard of his name in, like, you know, MBBA tournaments. I didn't know he was this good, though. Yeah. I, I knew Smash got, like, I knew Smash got to be the good one of the two. And I mean, maybe he still is, and he's just that good. But this is this is impressive. I didn't think Wallet would do well. <laughs> I I would put him like top 16, 100 percent. But this is very impressive, you know. But you know, unfortunately, he can't come to much stuff. So people think haven't gotten to right. see his yeah, skill. I mean, if he just really, really good fair grab. Okay, see, he's now he's getting punished for that bear again. It seems. I'm not saying he shouldn't do it, but it has worked far less than it hasn't. Mm. So I'm not sure if maybe he should just go for the more traditional edge guards. Those were not safe ledge jumps. No, not at all. Lot had like had been calling DJ out on doing stuff like that with dash attacks. Well, I think DJ does it so much. I think right. Because yeah. Okay. First game, Lot got punished heavily for down smashing up the ledge. So now I think he's holding back a little bit. Okay. Yep. Even up. Sheik's forward air is so good. Such a good move. It really is. It combos into itself. It combos into other moves. It kills you eventually. Such a good move. There it is. Nice staying on the ground. Uh, he just kind of got beat by that float down there. I don't yeah. think that's Well, Swedish was throwing out forward tilts, and Lod just stayed on the ground. So then Swedish stopped throwing out forward tilts, and then Lod jumped. So he kind of was like, he showed that he's not going to jump immediately. I don't like those needles. It worked out though. So I like them. Shut up, me. It's free well, percent. I just, well, like not that much, and all it does is let Peach up be it's like higher. It's sixteen percent. He does, he's not gonna get all of them like that though. He got like all of them. He definitely got like all of them. All right. Well, I just think like it lets. It worked out. Never mind. Never mind. You're right. <laughs> Uh, Hector Hertz and I were talking about this on stream earlier. Swedish delights decisions are very strange. Sometimes they don't make sense, but he wins, so we have to respect them. So I guess they're right. Yeah. Long back ear sequence. Yeah, this has been like a really Jesus. tight, nice edge guard. <laughs> it's good on Wad to be up being in a way that he can only get hit by the weak hit. Right. But the weak hit's gonna kill you eventually. Yeah, like he, he could have been killed like 20 seconds ago. Yeah. I guess it ultimately didn't matter, but it could have. Oh wow, big combo, big combo. I yeah, know, super I strange. Swedish looked really dominant game one. Lod looked really ga dominant game two, and now Swedish does game three. It's you know, I feel like there are a lot of players who have sets like that because they just they lose energy. Like uh, I definitely feel like PP is one of those players where he'll force stock people, and so then he'll wait, lose the set. Like you think. Are you suggesting Laud lost energy, or that like Swedish, Swedish had energy and then had like a dip? It's possible that they both had that like they're they're, they're uh, alternating dips. Yes, I've <laughs> seen sets like that. Uh -huh. It happens. All right, this counter pick pretty obvious. Yeah. He doesn't want to die early to forward air anymore. This is a strange needle. So I would have. So Swedish, he just saw that Law did down smash spot dodge, and he got hit from it. Next time, Swedish should do wave dash out of shield down smash because that beats the spot dodge. Just pointing it out. Uh, I agree. Nice forward tilt. Gets nothing off of it. Yeah, photo you know, on Yoshi's that would kill, but a lot smart would pick Dream Land. Swedish is being like very solid with these back air edge guards. Like it, they're taking a long time and stuff, but like he overall he's been doing a good job of just hitting him back. Oh, uh, dude, that's the worst feeling when you try to counter someone, but the counter 
as Martha or Peach, like, makes them miss, so then they just hit you right after. You know what I mean? Um, yeah, like, yeah. Because it stops your, yeah, your falling yeah, momentum. Yeah, yeah. So, like, that back air, if he hadn't countered, would have hit him. But, yeah. I mean, I don't know. Me I, I don't believe in Martha's counter. I just don't think it's any good. But that's just me. Nice grab. Peach has very few ledge options, and Martha yeah. and Sheik. So they can just cover like. What Martha and Sheik can do is that they can just stand at the ledge outside of getup attack range, and just wait. And if yeah. Sheik rolls, you turn around and grab. And if and they get up, you just. If if they get up, then Sheik can uh, forward tilt, or like short hop aerial, or Martha he just does he down tilts and then turns around and grab. Now so I Sheik really should have just done a short hop up there. It would have been the stock. You think so? I think so. Yeah. Probably. I mean, it's Dreamland, but this is NTSC. Whoa! Nice tech jab by Law. Oh, great okay. edge guard. That was amazing. Yeah, so the last couple times he did that, it didn't that work out. That was super good. Genius. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Okay. So the last couple times he did that edge guard, didn't work out. But this time he was like, I'm going to fake like I'm going for it, but I'm not. You know, I'm going to go to the ledge. Nice nair. Another nice nair. Oh, needle turnaround. Ooh, Ooh smack the needles. I, I I haven't heard that noise in years. <laughs> the, peach, uh, the peach forward smash noise. Nice tech away. Peach has a really hard time catching that. She's pretty slow. Yeah, and she's tech goes like pretty far right. Yeah. I think Lod was ready for that roll. Well, like kind of half expected it, but then like wasn't ready for it in a strange way. See, that's why I don't think the upper would have killed earlier. Dreamland's hella big, dude. I feel like after now the it will. I feel like after the forward but it air, Lod was at like 150. But yeah, okay. Uh, all That's right. kind of what I'm talking about when I'm saying dips in energy. Lod kind of actually did something like that earlier. He, he did a side B while trying to get to the ledge. I think he likely would have died anyway. Just, a, I mean, maybe Swedish would have too. I don't know. Yeah. But tight game. Ooh. Does Peach's down smash outrange Sheik's grab? Like, oh. Do you think he really was going for such a tight spacing so that he was out of that range? I don't know, but I do kind of find it funny when both people miss. You like bad melee, Vino? It's funny. It happens to Martha. Oh, a lot. dude, it's disgusting. That's why I hate watching me play. Oh, if Swedish, you know, Swedish could be utilizing down smash a little more. If he oh, ran up and down smash and instead of down tilted, it, it would have hit. Okay, forward air, but Dreamland. He might have a tough time coming back though. Swedish has been edge guarding really well. Never mind. Never oh. mind. But he can only get one nair off of it. Swedish is still in a good position. Oh, I don't know why he would... Oh, great grab. I'm confused why Swedish is down tilting when Peach, like, to get out of the corner, is going to end up floating. Oh, good back here. Okay. That'll do it. it. Good stuff. Congratulations to Vod on third place. Maybe I'm wrong.